Let's take, for example, a cross-section of this column having a dimension of 300 mm by 300 mm. The main reinforcement bars are 4 pieces 16 mm diameter bar and the lateral ties is 10 mm diameter bar. Concrete cover is 40 mm and the hook length is 75 mm. Now let's discuss first the ACI codes connected to this column. According to ACI code, the vertical or the main reinforcement of a rectangular column shall consist of at least 4 bars with a minimum diameter of 16 mm or number 5 bar. Some columns have more than 4 main reinforcement bars depending on the shape and size of column. The bigger the column means more reinforcement bar needed. For lateral ties, the ACI code specifies that 10 mm diameter bar is required if the main reinforcement bar is 32 mm or smaller. In our sample column, our main reinforcement bar is 16 mm which is smaller than 32 mm. So we use 10 mm diameter bar for our lateral ties. For main reinforcement greater than 32 mm, we use 12 mm diameter bar for lateral ties. The ACI code and the National Structural Code of the Philippines also specifies that for beams, columns, pedestals, tension ties not exposed to weather and not in contact with the ground, the specified concrete cover for primary reinforcements, stirrups, ties, spirals and hoops is 40 mm. The length of hoop for 135 degree hoop is 6D or 6 times the diameter of bar. But the code further specifies that the length of hook should not be less than 75 mm. Now let's discuss bend deduction. When we bend a steel bar, it will stretch to a certain degree. This additional length due to bending should be deducted in the calculation of cutting length of ties. For a 90 degree bend, it has a bend deduction of 2D or 2 times the bar diameter. And for 135 degree bend, the bend deduction is 3D or 3 times the bar diameter. Okay, so we have already discussed the ACI codes connected to our column. Now let's go to the formula for the cutting length of our ties. Cutting length is equal to 2 times A plus B plus hook length minus bend deductions. Let's compute this one at a time. If we examine carefully, 2 times A plus B is the perimeter of our lateral ties. If we subtract the concrete cover at both ends on one side of our ties, it will give us 220 mm length. So therefore, 2 times A plus B is equal to 2 times 220 plus 220 is equal to 880 mm. For the hook length, since there are two 135 degree hook, we multiply 2 times 75 and it will give us a total hook length of 150 mm. For bend deduction, since there are 3 pieces 90 degree bend, we multiply 3 times 2D which is equal to 3 times 2 times 10 and is equal to 60 mm. For bend deduction on 135 degree bend, we multiply 2 times 3D since there are 2 135 degree hook. So 2 times 3D is equal to 2 times 3 times 10 and is equal to 60 mm also. Therefore, the total bend deduction is 120 mm. Going back to the formula, cutting length is equal to 2 times A plus B plus hook length minus bend deduction, which is equal to 880 plus 150 minus 120 and is equal to 910 mm. Therefore, the final cutting length of our lateral ties is 91 cm.